when to go on his own, when to manage the game and run the team, but do both of those things. To contend, no doubt. And the Pac-12. They begin with one of those turnovers, Keontae Kennedy. Well, in the game in a lot of ways, but it starts on the defensive end with him. Morgan gets to the glass. It's his first. Foul is called on judge number six, Ronnie J. One of nine from three-point range for Cal to begin this contest. Ronnie on transition. Nice. Able to spin it through. Uh, avoid the defender and still get it up on the window. Seven unanswered for USC. But this is the thing. James goes to work with a left-handed dribble. And Celestine, who missed all of last season with knee surgery rehabilitation. It's interesting for the most, and that's been an issue for USC. The last five games, they're averaging about 22 fouls a game. So that was obviously talked about. Layup. Mistake by Morgan there. Uh, what I find is right. Rodman knocks it down. Amac in deep against Bronny James. Morgan. Amac scores. Again, okay, not the way the game's being officiated. Interesting when Collier takes it away. Here's the decision there. Running with Bronny. <laughs> the nation's top recruit to Bronny James. Uh, Bronny James up in the air. You just hope that Collier was going to make the right decision, and he did put it right on the money. Isaiah Collier. Six points, five assists, no turnovers. Great. Come with the basketball for Cal. Over to Rodney Brown Jr. He's an injury disrupted as it is. Rodman right back from the corner. Amak using his shot fake. Drive and dish. Ronnie, another defense. Four ties, seven lead changes. And you got to run a play. A really, really good minutes for Bronny James. Didn't you know it? Maybe you speed up a little bit. You rush things. Cal turns it over. James back in for USC. James takes the screen, rises for three. Oh, that's a second time, a high ball screen. That's now on the hit head. Collier behind the Cal defense takes the contact and converts. Now a trap, able to get out of it. Newell, seen two Another defenders. Trap. Hornery rips it out. Nice pass ahead. Boogie. Good things in that first half for USC. The defense, to me, was more into it, more intense. Their offense. It's a pretty impactful eight minutes there. Easy offense, three for three, six points. Those deflections. He's got you at 3 0 atop yep. the league standings right now. Yep. Harrison Hornery. Good ball. Hits. Five of its last seven from the floor. So some good action here in the second half. A the Golden Bears giving USC a taste of its own medicine uh, tonight. Ronnie They're more than capable of outscoring the Bruins. Johnson step back three. Oh, he's second half fouls between the teams. And another, you bring it up, JB, that was USC, their defense struggling. A big part of it is they were fouling. Oh, Off to Bronny, downhill. Lays it in with the left. Bronny James. I thought he was on four. Over to Bronny. Nice. Oh, everything banged up. You can see he's wearing all kinds of body armor. Only shooting 20% from three as Kobe Johnson gets downhill. I think these players are looking. Bring the legs back to Bronny in transition. He and Collier playing with some swagger tonight. Now the back out. Great catch. A Rodman family in attendance tonight at Galen Center. It's been a good performance. Speaking of James, Enfield brings Bronny in for defensive purposes. The first by Rodman. Bronny James has the rebound, and with 2.7, he will go to the line. Next, USC. They may, we may be talking about USC here in a couple weeks on a three or four game win streak. Second foul shot for a 10 point night for Bronny James. He's got it. Tyson's heave at the horn, and USC wins it, 82-74.